I have come to realize that we all have addictions. I mean from the negative aspect of it, nothing positive about it. We all have addictions, but sometimes we don't really know that we have them just because we have an erroneous definition of, or rather an erroneous understanding of addiction. We think that addiction is when somebody is you know, roaming the street under the influence of alcohol or drug. That is just a category of it. That is substance addiction. We, the person is addicted to a, to a substance, alcohol, drug, or what have you. But we have behavioral addiction as well. Something like gambling, gaming, betting, I mean, internet, sex, those things, they are all addictions. But we neglect them. Whatever is bad, you know that it is bad. You want to stop it, but you find it difficult to stop it. It is already an addiction to you. Let us sit down and ask ourselves, am I addicted to what? There are some people who are married, but they cannot stick to their partner. They run from this person to the other person. They are hiding. Where are you hiding? You think that you are okay. You are not okay. You are addicted to that thing. You cannot control yourself. You are a young girl, you are a young boy, you run from one bed to the other. It is an addiction. You have to fight against it. You cannot pass a week. Any slightest money you have, you go for betting. It is an addiction. Your house is burning, but you already you are there outside in the film hall, watching Premier League, La Liga, and all the rest of them. But your house is burning down. That is an addiction. If you want, you see, drinking alcohol is not bad, but we know it becomes an addiction when you can no longer control yourself. So watching games is not bad, but it becomes an addiction when you can no longer control yourself. So many of us are addicted to something. But let me just go a bit deeper, because I asked the uh, artificial intelligence, what is an addiction? And they said that it's a chronic brain disorder characterized by compulsive seeking and use of substances or behaviors despite harmful consequences you know we say that people are addicted when we see these physical harmful consequences but the other things that we do they have spiritual consequences spiritual harmful consequences but we don't we don't look at them they are sins but because we don't see these harmful consequences we neglect them be very careful that your private sin it is an addiction fight against it it can destroy you at the long run or you destroy it and i prefer you destroy it before it destroys you fight against addiction that thing you want to stop but you cannot stop it because you think that you derive pleasure from it be careful you may already be under addiction without knowing we all have addictions Fight against it today before it destroys you. Destroy it today before it destroys you. May God help us.